Area is the quantity that expresses the extent of a two-dimensional figure or shape, or planar lamina, in the plane. Surface area is its analogue on the two-dimensional surface of a three-dimensional object. Area can be understood as the amount of material with a given thickness that would be necessary to fashion a model of the shape, or the amount of paint necessary to cover the surface with a single coat. It is the two-dimensional analog of the length of a curve, a one-dimensional concept, or the volume of a solid, a three-dimensional concept. The area of a shape can be measured by comparing the shape to squares of a fixed size. In the International System of Units (SI), the standard unit of area is the square meter, written as m2, which is the area of a square whose sides are one meter long. A shape with an area of three square meters would have the same area as three such squares. In mathematics, the unit square is defined to have area 1, and the area of any other shape or surface is a dimensionless real number. There are several well-known formulas for the areas of simple shapes such as triangles, rectangles, and circles. Using these formulas, the area of any polygon can be found by dividing the polygon into triangles. For shapes with curved boundary, calculus is usually required to compute the area. Indeed, the problem of determining the area of plane figures was a major motivation for the historical development of calculus. For a solid shape such as a sphere, cone, or cylinder, the area of its boundary surface is called the surface area. Formulas for the surface areas of simple shapes were computed by the ancient Greeks, but computing the surface area of a more complicated shape usually requires multivariable calculus. Area plays an important role in modern mathematics. In addition to its obvious importance in geometry and calculus, area is related to the definition of determinants in linear algebra, and is a basic property of surfaces in differential geometry. In analysis, the area of a subset of the plane is defined using Lebesgue measure, though not every subset is measurable. In general, area in higher mathematics is seen as a special case of volume for two dimensional regions. Area can be defined through the use of axioms, defining it as a function of a collection of certain plane figures to the set of real numbers. It can be proved that such a function exists. Topic: <laughs> Formal definition. An approach to defining what is meant by area is through axioms. Area can be defined as a function from a collection M of special kind of plane figures termed measurable sets to the set of real numbers which satisfies the following properties For all s in M, A s 0. If s and t are in M then so are s t and s t, and also A s t equals A s plus A t minus A s t. If s and t are in M with s t then t minus s is in M and a t minus s equals a t minus a s. If a set s is in M and s is congruent to t then t is also in M and a s equals a t. Every rectangle r is in M if the rectangle has length h and breadth k then a r equals h k. Let Q be a set enclosed between two step regions S and T. A step region is formed from a finite union of adjacent rectangles resting on a common base, i.e. SQT. If there is a unique number C such that A S C A T for all such step regions S and T, then A Q equals C, it can be proved that such an area function actually exists. <laughs> Units equals Every unit of length has a corresponding unit of area, namely the area of a square with the given side length. Thus areas can be measured in square meters m2, square centimeters cm2, square millimeters m2, square kilometers km2, square feet feet2, square yards yd2, square miles mi2, and so forth. Algebraically, these units can be thought of as the squares of the corresponding length units. The SI unit of area is the square meter, which is considered an SI-derived unit. Conversions Calculation of the area of a square whose length and width are 1 meter would be 1 meter by 1 meter equals 1 square meter and so a rectangle with different sides say length of 3 meters and width of 2 meters would have an area in square units that can be calculated as 3 meters by 2 meters equals 6 square meters 
This is equivalent to 6 million square millimeters. Other useful conversions are 1 square kilometer equals 1 million square meters 1 square meter topic 10000 square centimeters 1 million square millimeters 1 square centimeter equals 100 square millimeters equals topic non metric units equals in non metric units the conversion between two square units is the square of the conversion between the corresponding length units 1 foot equals 12 inches the relationship between square feet and square inches is 1 square foot topic 144 square inches where 144 122 equals 12 times 12 similarly 1 square yard equals 9 square feet 1 square mile topic 3,097,600 square yards 27,878,400 square feet in addition conversion factors include 1 square inch equals 6.4516 square centimeters 1 square foot equals 0 0.09290304 square meters 1 square yard equals 0 0.83612736 square meters 1 square mile equals 2 589988110336 square kilometers equals topic other units including historical equals there are several other common units for area the air was the original unit of area in the metric system with 1 air equals 100 square metres though the air has fallen out of use the hectare is still commonly used to measure land 1 hectare topic 100 rs 10000 square meters equals 0.01 square kilometre so other uncommon metric units of area include the tetrad the hectad and the myriad the acre is also commonly used to measure land areas, where 1 acre <laughs> 4,840 square yards 43,560 square feet, an acre is approximately 40% of a hectare. On the atomic scale, area is measured in units of barns, such that 1 barn equals 10 minus 28 square meters. The barn is commonly used in describing the cross sectional area of interaction in nuclear physics. In India, 20 dir ki equals 1 dir, 20 dir equals 1 katha, 20 kata equals 1 biga, 32 kata equals 1 acre equals History equals topic circle area in the 5th century bce hippocrates of chios was the first to show that the area of a disk the region enclosed by a circle is proportional to the square of its diameter as part of his quadrature of the lune of hippocrates but did not identify the constant of proportionality Eudoxus of Cnidus, also in the 5th century BCE, also found that the area of a disk is proportional to its radius squared. Subsequently, Book I of Euclid's Elements dealt with equality of areas between two dimensional figures. 
The mathematician Archimedes used the tools of Euclidean geometry to show that the area inside a circle is equal to that of a right triangle whose base has the length of the circle's circumference and whose height equals the circle's radius. In his book Measurement of a Circle, the circumference is 2 pi r, and the area of a triangle is half the base times the height, yielding the area pi r2 for the disk. Archimedes approximated the value of pi and hence the area of a unit radius circle with his doubling method, in which he inscribed a regular triangle in a circle and noted its area, then doubled the number of sides to give a regular hexagon, then repeatedly doubled the number of sides as the polygon's area got closer and closer to that of the circle and did the same with circumscribed polygons. Swiss scientist Johann Heinrich Lambert in 1761 proved that pi, the ratio of a circle's area to its squared radius, is irrational, meaning it is not equal to the quotient of any two whole numbers. In 1794, French mathematician Adrien Marie Legendre proved that π2 is irrational. This also proves that π is irrational. In 1882, German mathematician Ferdinand von Lindemann proved that π is transcendental, not the solution of any polynomial equation with rational coefficients, confirming a conjecture made by both Legendre and Euler. Topic: <laughs> Triangle area. Heron or Hero of Alexandria found what is known as Heron's formula for the area of a triangle in terms of its sides, and a proof can be found in his book, Metrica, written around 60 CE. It has been suggested that Archimedes knew the formula over two centuries earlier, and since Metrica is a collection of the mathematical knowledge available in the ancient world, it is possible that the formula predates the reference given in that work. In 499 Aryabhata, a great mathematician astronomer from the classical age of Indian mathematics and Indian astronomy, expressed the area of a triangle as one half the base times the height in the Aryabhatiya. A formula equivalent to Heron's was discovered by the Chinese independently of the Greeks. It was published in 1247 in Shushu Juzong, Mathematical Treatise in Nine Sections, written by Qin Zhushao. Topic: <laughs> Quadrilateral Area. In the 7th century CE, Brahmagupta developed a formula, now known as Brahmagupta's formula, for the area of a cyclic quadrilateral a quadrilateral inscribed in a circle in terms of its sides. In 1842 the German mathematicians Karl Anton Bretschneider and Karl Georg Christian von Stott independently found a formula, known as Bretschneider's formula, for the area of any quadrilateral. General polygon area The development of Cartesian coordinates by René Descartes in the 17th century allowed the development of the surveyor's formula for the area of any polygon with known vertex locations by Gauss in the 19th century. <laughs> Areas determined using calculus The development of integral calculus in the late 17th century provided tools that could subsequently be used for computing more complicated areas, such as the area of an ellipse and the surface areas of various curved three-dimensional objects. <laughs> area formulas Polygon formulas For a non-self-intersecting simple polygon the cartesian coordinates x i y i display style x underscore i y underscore i i equals 0 1 n1 of whose n vertices are known the area is given by the surveyor's formula a equals 1 2 i equals 0 n minus 1 x i y i plus 1 minus x i plus 1 y i 
Display style a equals frac 1 2 sum underscore i equals 0 caret n 1 x underscore i y underscore i plus 1 x underscore i plus 1 y underscore i. Where when i equals n 1, then i plus 1 is expressed as modulus n, and so refers to 0. Topic: Rectangles. The most basic area formula is the formula for the area of a rectangle. Given a rectangle with length l and width w, the formula for the area is a equals l w rectangle. That is, the area of the rectangle is the length multiplied by the width. As a special case, as l equals w in the case of a square, the area of a square with side length s is given by the formula a equals s2 square the formula for the area of a rectangle follows directly from the basic properties of area and is sometimes taken as a definition or axiom on the other hand if geometry is developed before arithmetic this formula can be used to define multiplication of real numbers equals topic dissection parallelograms and triangles Equals Most other simple formulas for area follow from the method of dissection. This involves cutting a shape into pieces, whose areas must sum to the area of the original shape. For an example, any parallelogram can be subdivided into a trapezoid and a right triangle, as shown in figure to the left. If the triangle is moved to the other side of the trapezoid, then the resulting figure is a rectangle. It follows that the area of the parallelogram is the same as the area of the rectangle. A equals bh parallelogram. However, the same parallelogram can also be cut along a diagonal into two congruent triangles, as shown in the figure to the right. It follows that the area of each triangle is half the area of the parallelogram. A equals one two b h. Display style a equals frac one two b h. Triangle. Similar arguments can be used to find area formulas for the trapezoid as well as more complicated polygons. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Area of curved shapes. Topic: <inaudible> 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 Circles. The formula for the area of a circle, more properly called the area enclosed by a circle or the area of a disk, is based on a similar method. Given a circle of radius r, it is possible to partition the circle into sectors, as shown in the figure to the right. Each sector is approximately triangular in shape, and the sectors can be rearranged to form an approximate parallelogram. The height of this parallelogram is r, and the width is half the circumference of the circle, or pi r. Thus, the total area of the circle is pi r2. A equals pi r2 circle. Though the dissection used in this formula is only approximate, the error becomes smaller and smaller as the circle is partitioned into more and more sectors. The limit of the areas of the approximate parallelograms is exactly pi r2, which is the area of the circle. This argument is actually a simple application of the ideas of calculus. In ancient times, the method of exhaustion was used in a similar way to find the area of the circle, and this method is now recognized as a precursor to integral calculus. Using modern methods, the area of a circle can be computed using a definite integral a equals 2 minus r r r 2 minus x 2 d x equals pi r 2 display style a equals 2 int underscore r caret r sqrt r caret 2 x caret 2 dx equals pi r caret 2 topic ellipses The formula for the area enclosed by an ellipse is related to the formula of a circle. For an ellipse with semi-major and semi-minor axes x and y, the formula is a equals pi x y. Display style a equals pi x y. 
Topic: <laughs> Surface area. Most basic formulas for surface area can be obtained by cutting surfaces and flattening them out. For example, if the side surface of a cylinder or any prism is cut lengthwise, the surface can be flattened out into a rectangle. Similarly, if a cut is made along the side of a cone, the side surface can be flattened out into a sector of a circle, and the resulting area computed. The formula for the surface area of a sphere is more difficult to derive, because a sphere has nonzero Gaussian curvature, it cannot be flattened out. The formula for the surface area of a sphere was first obtained by Archimedes in his work on the sphere and cylinder. The formula is a equals 4 pi r2 sphere where r is the radius of the sphere as with the formula for the area of a circle any derivation of this formula inherently uses methods similar to calculus equals topic general formulas equals topic areas of two dimensional figures A triangle one two B H display style tfrac one two B H, where B is any side and H is the distance from the line on which B lies to the other vertex of the triangle. This formula can be used if the height H is known. If the lengths of the three sides are known, then Heron's formula can be used. S S minus A S minus B S minus C display style sqrt s s a s b s c, where a b c are the sides of the triangle, and S equals one two a plus b plus c. Display style s equals t f r a c one two a plus b plus c is half of its perimeter. If an angle and its two included sides are given, the area is one two a b sin c. Display style t f r a c one two ab sin c, where c is the given angle and a and b are its included sides. If the triangle is graphed on a coordinate plane, a matrix can be used and is simplified to the absolute value of 1 2 x 1 y 2 plus x 2 y 3 plus x 3 y 1 minus x 2 y 1 minus x 3 y 2 minus x 1 y 3 Display style tfrac one two x underscore one y underscore two plus x underscore two y underscore three plus x underscore three y underscore one x underscore two y underscore one x underscore three y underscore two x underscore one y underscore three. This formula is also known as the shoelace formula and is an easy way to solve for the area of a coordinate triangle by substituting the three points x1, y1, x2, y2, and x3, y3. The shoelace formula can also be used to find the areas of other polygons when their vertices are known. Another approach for a coordinate triangle is to use calculus to find the area. A simple polygon constructed on a grid of equal distanced points i.e., points with integer coordinates such that all the polygon's vertices are grid points i plus b 2 minus 1 display style i plus frac b 2 minus 1 where i is the number of grid points inside the polygon and b is the number of boundary points this result is known as Pick's theorem. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Area in calculus. 
The area between a positive valued curve and the horizontal axis, measured between two values A and B B is defined as the larger of the two values on the horizontal axis, is given by the integral from A to B of the function that represents the curve A equals A B F X D X Display style A equals in underscore a carrot B F X D X the area between the graphs of two functions is equal to the integral of one function f x minus the integral of the other function g x a equals a b f x minus g x d x Display style a equals int underscore a caret b f x g x d x where f x display style f x is the curve with the greater y value, an area bounded by a function r equals r theta, expressed in polar coordinates as a equals one two r two d theta. Display style a equals one over two in r caret two d theta. The area enclosed by a parametric curve U T equals X T Y T Display style VEC U T equals X T Y T with endpoints U T zero equals U T one Display style VEC U T underscore zero equals VEC U T underscore one is given by the line integrals T zero T one X Y D T equals minus T zero T one Y x d t equals one two t zero t one x y minus y x d t Display style point underscore t underscore zero carrot t underscore one x dot y dt equals point underscore t underscore zero carrot t underscore one y dot x dt equals one over two point underscore t underscore zero carrot t underscore one x dot y y dot x dt. See Green's theorem or the z component of one two t. Zero T one U times U D T Display style one over two point underscore T underscore zero carrot T underscore one VEC U times dot VEC U D T Topic Bounded area between two quadratic functions To find the bounded area between two quadratic functions, we subtract one from the other to write the difference as f x minus g x equals a x two plus b x plus c equals a x minus alpha x minus beta display style f x g x equals x caret 2 plus b x plus c equals a x alpha x beta where f x is the quadratic upper bound and g x is the quadratic lower bound define the discriminant of f x g x as delta equals b 
2 minus 4 a c display style delta equals b caret 2 minus 4 ac by simplifying the integral formula between the graphs of two functions as given in the section above and using vieta's formula we can obtain o equals delta delta 6 a 2 equals a 6 beta minus alpha 3 a does not equal 0 Display style a equals frac delta sqrt delta six a caret two equals frac a six beta alpha caret three q quad n e q zero. The above remains valid if one of the bounding functions is linear instead of quadratic. Topic: Surface area of three-dimensional figures. Cone. Pi R R plus R two plus H two display style pi R left R plus sqrt R caret two plus H caret two right, where R is the radius of the circular base and H is the height. That can also be rewritten as pi R two plus pi r l display style pi r caret 2 plus pi r l or pi r r plus l display style pi r r plus l where r is the radius and l is the slant height of the cone pi r 2 Display style pi r caret two is the base area, while pi r l display style pi r l is the lateral surface area of the cone. Cube six s two display style six s caret two, where s is the length of an edge. Cylinder two pi R R plus H display style two pi R R plus H, where R is the radius of a base and H is the height. The two pi display style pi R can also be rewritten as pi display style pi d, where d is the diameter. Prism 2b plus pH, where b is the area of a base, p is the perimeter of a base, and h is the height of the prism. Pyramid b plus p l 2 display style b plus frac place 2, where b is the area of the base, p is the perimeter of the base, and l is the length of the slant. Rectangular prism 2. W plus H plus W H display style two L W plus L H plus W H where display style L is the length, W is the width, and H is the height. Topic: General formula for surface area. The general formula for the surface area of the graph of a continuously differentiable function z equals f x y display style z equals f x y where x y element of d r 2 Display style x y in d subset math b r caret two and d display style d is a region in the x y plane with the smooth boundary a equals d f x two plus f y 
2 plus 1 d x d y Display style a equals i i n t underscore d s q r t left f r a c partial f partial x right caret two plus left f r a c partial f partial y right caret two plus one d x die. An even more general formula for the area of the graph of a parametric surface in the vector form r equals r u v Display style math bfr equals math bfr u v, where r display style math bfr is a continuously differentiable vector function of u v element of d r two display style u v in d subset math b r caret two is equals d r u times r v d u d v display style a equals i i n t underscore d left frac partial math b f r partial u times frac partial math b f r partial v right do d v List of formulas The above calculations show how to find the areas of many common shapes. The areas of irregular polygons can be calculated using the «surveyor's formula». <laughs> Relation of area to perimeter The isoparametric inequality states that, for a closed curve of length L so the region it encloses has perimeter L and for area A of the region that it encloses 4 pi a L 2 display style 4 pi a L e q L 2 and equality holds if and only if the curve is a circle. Thus a circle has the largest area of any closed figure with a given perimeter. At the other extreme, a figure with given perimeter L could have an arbitrarily small area, as illustrated by a rhombus that is «tipped over» arbitrarily far so that two of its angles are arbitrarily close to 0 degrees and the other two are arbitrarily close to 180 degrees. For a circle, the ratio of the area to the circumference the term for the perimeter of a circle equals half the radius r. This can be seen from the area formula π r2 and the circumference formula 2 π r. The area of a regular polygon is half its perimeter times the apothem where the apothem is the distance from the center to the nearest point on any side. Topic: <laughs> Fractals. Doubling the edge lengths of a polygon multiplies its area by 4, which is 2 the ratio of the new to the old side length raised to the power of 2, the dimension of the space the polygon resides in. But if the one-dimensional lengths of a fractal drawn in two dimensions are all doubled, the spatial content of the fractal scales by a power of two that is not necessarily an integer. This power is called the fractal dimension of the fractal. <laughs> Area bisectors There are an infinitude of lines that bisect the area of a triangle. Three of them are the medians of the triangle which connect the sides midpoints with the opposite vertices, and these are concurrent at the triangle's centroid, indeed, they are the only area bisectors that go through the centroid. Any line through a triangle that splits both the triangle's area and its perimeter in half goes through the triangle's incenter the center of its incircle. There are either one, two, or three of these for any given triangle. Any line through the midpoint of a parallelogram bisects the area. All area bisectors of a circle or other ellipse go through the center, and any chords through the center bisect the area. In the case of a circle they are the diameters of the circle. Optimization Given a wire contour, the surface of least area spanning filling 
It is a minimal surface. Familiar examples include soap bubbles. The question of the filling area of the Riemannian circle remains open. The circle has the largest area of any two-dimensional object having the same perimeter. A cyclic polygon, one inscribed in a circle, has the largest area of any polygon with a given number of sides of the same lengths. A version of the isoparametric inequality for triangles states that the triangle of greatest area among all those with a given perimeter is equilateral, the triangle of largest area of all those inscribed in a given circle is equilateral, and the triangle of smallest area of all those circumscribed around a given circle is equilateral. The ratio of the area of the incircle to the area of an equilateral triangle π 3 3 Display style frac pi 3 sqrt 3 is larger than that of any non-equilateral triangle. The ratio of the area to the square of the perimeter of an equilateral triangle 1 12 3 display style frac 1 12 sqrt 3 is larger than that for any other triangle. See also Brahmagupta quadrilateral, a cyclic quadrilateral with integer sides, integer diagonals, and integer area. Equi-aerial mapping Huronian triangle, a triangle with integer sides and integer area. List of triangle inequalities Hashtag area 1 7th area triangle, an inner triangle with 1 7th the area of the reference triangle, Routh's theorem, a generalization of the 1 7th area triangle, orders of magnitude area. A list of areas by size. Pentagon hashtag derivation of the area formula Planimeter, an instrument for measuring small areas, e.g. on maps. Quadrilateral hashtag area of a convex quadrilateral Robbins pentagon, a cyclic pentagon whose side lengths and area are all rational numbers. <laughs>